traffic came up, I was the Walmart greeter, welcomed the people to them, and uh, embarrassed the kids and said, we have only one rule when you come to our farm, you must have fun and make sure your parents do the same. And then if they were new, I, I thanked them for coming. If they were old, I thanked them for coming back as an old customers. Uh, I also told them, uh, if you see somebody in an orange shirt, just so happens I have one on, uh, if you have any questions, uh, please ask them. If they don't have the answer, please come see me. I'll have them fired immediately because of family. <laughs> so that was it. Uh, I think the people appreciated it, and, and, and we did get questions. So they felt warm and, and, and kind of friendly right out the door. So, so and I work from Ontario, so the Walmart greeter is kind of a new thing. Then I had a try an apple, and some people do slices, and some people don't do that. And yes, I even did Honeycrisp, but I couldn't afford to give the apples away this year. And what it really did was turn people on to an apple that maybe they would never have tried or bought before, and now they've developed a taste for something else and in future years that they'll come back and get. So it was a way to get rid of excess apples and pick them off the tree instead of leaving them hanging on the trees, like many of us have had to do. I also, for the same token, did almost every church and food banks, did every Thanksgiving basket thing I could give away because it just hurt me as it sure all of you to leave your apples on the trees. So just goodwill to get them to get them off the trees and out there. Excellent. The uh, widely listened to radio station is TCM. The most cost effective advertising I can do is take them in thirty dozen and they talk about it for twenty minutes while I'm there. They do a uh, news all day long about it. You couldn't buy the kind of advertising we get from that, and everybody in the country knows we got sweet corn starting today. <laughs> Where she would prefer to be. Um, we did uh, texting this year. Uh, we had people text when they got there, um, text when they left. Uh, they got um, they by texting they would be able to get a something in the cafe or something to eat or drink. They did texting in the corn maze. Uh, we used texting to um, try how long they were in the maze. So they text when they went in, text when they came out. Um, one of the nice things about texting is that you capture their numbers so that you can now do like an e-blast except it's text messaging. And uh, um, everybody that's got a cell phone, most people these days can text, uh, even if they're my age. Uh, I don't know how to respond to it, but I, I know I can get it. Uh, if it says yes, I can go down and scroll down yes, uh, or no, or go to somewhere. But uh, So we collected several thousand uh, text numbers so that you know, people that have been on the farm that we can hopefully use in the future to uh, encourage them to come back, uh, thank them for coming. Uh, so I think that we also have a haunted house and we used that in the haunted house. We used it on in advertising where they could uh, text in addition to going to our website, they could text for a special offer. Um, so uh, I, I think it's up and coming or here, whatever. We had a point where before admissions, if you put in the number, you get a dollar off your admissions. We had another one where you could get a dollar off food, another one you could enter contests. And we changed our maze up this year from the punch cards um, to texting. And on all on numerous survey cards, people are objecting to the texting. They want us to go back to the cards. So they objected because they didn't have it on their phone. It was extra cost. They had a family that they were challenged to get all these points in the maze. And uh, some of them just downright didn't know how to use it. So um, I don't know if we'll do a combination next year, but it did not go over well on our farm, and, and it was very obvious on the survey cards that they fell out at the maze instead of the uh, punch cards.